Density. Density is the amount of particles in a given amount of space. Density can also determine buoyancy, which is whether, whether an object will sink or float due to other forces. So how do you decide the density? How do you discover the density? Well, density has a formula. The formula is density is equal to mass divided by volume. This can also be expressed as D equals M over V. Mass is the amount of, the amount of matter in an object. And volume is the amount of space something takes up. So, let's now use a simulation to discover the density of this bl blue square and eventually find whether it is buoyant in water or not. First, we'll find the mass. Measuring mass always use grams. And this scale tells me that the mass is 78 grams. So let's record that. Next, we want to find the volume. In order to find the volume, we can use something called water displacement. You get, you use a graduated cylinder, filled, partially filled with water. Then, you stick the, you put an object in it. And you find how hot, how m much, m how much the water has risen. That is your volume. And here the simulation has already told me the volume. 29 milliliters. So, now let's do some division. 78 divided by 29, rounding to the tenth, tenth is 2.7. For your units, you should do grams per milliliter. So, now let's see if this is, let's see if this blue square will sink or float. It sinks. Why is this? It is because water's density is 1. Any object with a density greater than 1 will sink. Any, dense, any object with the density low, Lo less than one will float. Right now, this density is set on zero, and the object of this blue square is 2.7, meaning that it is greater than it is greater than one. So the triangle for density is. Density is equal to mass divided by volume. Yet, volume is equal to mass divided by density. And mass is equal to density times volume, which makes it perf which fits perfectly.